the whole train just disappeared. It's unbelievable. A telegraph. I had thought that all station masters knew the Morse code, but apparently not. Ah, oh, will I ever get any peace? Ah, oh, will I ever get any peace? A telegraph. A fishing advertisement. This bin is full of empty bottles.
a handcar wheelbase. Interesting. It appears that elements of the same construction were scattered everywhere. Watson, please tell me, do you believe in magic? Of course not, Holmes. Then you are of the opinion that a train cannot simply disappear? Well, we both know that that is obvious. Why are you asking such peculiar questions? A little patience, Watson. You will understand my point quite soon. So, are you quite certain that you saw the train at Evesham Station? Yes, of course. We saw it coming. The headlights and heard the whistle. But that is it. We didn't see the train itself. Oh, uh, but... Oh, Holmes, I'm a little confused. I should use the appropriate object here. 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 I should use the appro- I should use the
so. Now here we have the fake train that we saw approaching Evesham Station last night. Doesn't look much like a train to me. Be patient, Watson. I haven't finished yet. Try using your imagination. Our train requires only a headlight and a steam whistle. We need to attach a headlight and a steam... The whole train just... The long pole is now attached. It will allow us to connect the headlight. The headlight is attached. The steam whistle is now connected. Holmes, what can we do to make the steam whistle work? It is elementary, my dear Watson. We shall need a fire extinguisher. Holmes, how is it even possible for a train to... Locked. There is no sense in asking the station master to open it. We shall have to pick the lock. Railway post bags. These tools were used quite recently. They are still muddy. We should ask about them. You have quite a number of dirty tools lying around here. Ah, yes. Well, thank you for reminding me. I should clean them. Although, it might be easier to put them outside. Seems it might start raining soon. I meant, what were they used for? Some workers come here and borrowed them from me. They wanted to lift the edge of the railway to one of the stations on the line, so that the water wouldn't come in too close. Who were these workers? 
Well, they didn't seem to be from the company, but they was fine lads. They invited me to share a drink. <laughs> and whatever it was, it had a kick to it. They wasn't English. No, I don't believe so. But see, they knew just what a man needed to brighten up his dull evening. The whole train just disappeared. It's unbelievable. What can we do to make the steam whistle work? It is elementary, my dear Watson. We shall need a fire extinguisher. the fire extinguisher. Now let us see what we have here. First of all, let us pump the pressure inside the extinguisher. The steam whistle is ready to be used. Watson, I do believe that we have created an exact replica of the train that vanished in front of us last night. The criminal mind can be most inventive. I am somewhat in awe. So, such a thing is possible. If someone went to all the trouble of creating this fake train, then it was surely with the intention of stealing the real one. Ah, Watson, you should not jump to conclusions. In fact, this does not tell us very much at all except that the train did not evaporate into thin air. Although you half suspected it. Huh. At any rate, we now need to find where the real train might be hidden. I suggest we use my archives to find a more detailed map of our surroundings. Well, I hope that justifies our having to load your massive archive suitcase onto the cab. It made us extremely unpopular with our driver. Railway post bags. Bags were recently dragged here.
French wine, a remarkable vintage. These bottles are too expensive for a station master's wage. They were likely taken from the parcels. Shameful. Peace. The whole train just disappeared. It's unbelievable. The entire train has disappeared. Railway post bags. An old locomotive bell. This part is probably from a locomotive. A telegraph. The whole train just disappeared. It's unbelievable.
railway sleepers, nothing unusual. There are no tracks or footprints on the ground. It's a scandal, an absolute outrage. According to this document, you have insurance for your prototype. Oh, thank God. Where did you find it? Near the telegraph station. I must have lost it when I tried to send a message, which I was prevented from doing. I apologize for that, but regulations state that public access to the telegraph is strictly prohibited. Upon my word, you keep on digging that hole of yours. You have no idea who I am. I see that you kept your grip sack with you. Why don't you leave it in the luggage room? I've had other things to think about. I lost my prototype. And this idiot station master just stands here doing nothing to help. Oh, but... Well, that won't do at all. Station Master, I believe that the regulations state that any passenger luggage should be taken to the luggage room. I'll do it right away, sir. Sorry, sir. This Robinson is quite a character. We should learn more about him. I will not move from here until I receive my refund. Railway post bags. This grip sack belongs to Mr. Robinson. I think we should open it, Holmes. This is what they call force majeure. I'll keep watch. Of course. Look, Watson, a bundle of contracts. Very suspicious. An exclusive. Mr. Robinson is the seller.
Yet another exclu... Mr. Robinson is the seller. Yet another exclusive sales contract. Mr. Robinson is the seller. Yet another exclusive sales contract. Mr. Robinson is the seller. Well, it is very clear that this Mr. Robinson received prepayments from various people for his machine. I will not move from here until I receive my refund. Don't touch anything, please. <laughs> 